Of course, the reigning Rookie of the Year joins us, Luka Doncic from the Dallas Mavericks. I want to jump right into this because earlier Coach Carlisle, he stated, quote, I wouldn't trade him for anybody. You're known for making players better. So when you hear Coach Carlisle say that, you say what? I'm impressed, you know. Uh, there's uh, amazing players in this league, you know, so many great players. So I'm just, uh, I'm just uh, glad. I mean, he said that. It just makes me feel happy. So now that one of those great players is no longer on the team, Dirk retires last season, you inherit being one of the faces of the franchise. So what are some of the pointers he shared with you, maybe from last season or even after he's retired? I mean, there's a lot of things I learned from Dirk just in one year. Imagine if I would be more around. But, you know, he's going to stick around here. He, he lives in Dallas, and uh, he gave me a lot of advices, you know, but... The best advice I got uh, in my life was have fun on, on the court. That's, that's the advice I always take. So you definitely had fun last season, eight triple doubles, put on a show. The Luka mania was crazy, but now you have a running mate, Kristaps Porzingis. I know you're looking forward to the challenge of playing with him. What about his game do you feel complements you the most? Uh, there's a lot of things he can do, you know. I just, uh, he can shoot, you know, he scores high, he can shoot uh, over anybody no but he's shooting his defense he can block any shots and you know i'm just happy we have we have him on the mess so i've noticed there's been a little body transformation i've seen that kp's been in the gym he's put on a lot of muscle uh, i've been told that you're a lot more sculpted and more defined what was the the, the thought process in the off season to change your body up i mean it was just uh the first off season i had uh I had a rest like more than one month, you know, it was a great summer for me. Uh, I rest enough, I practice, you know, uh, take care of my body and that was, that was the key for this summer. So before you entered the NBA, we all know you had a ton of success overseas, countless awards and achievements. So you claimed the Rookie of the Year and you had to keep a level head. How did you do that with all the, the, the Luka hype last season? How did you maintain a, an even keel and focus on basketball? I mean, that's uh, since I was 16, you know, it's just a process, you know. I had uh, guys in Real Madrid that helped me, helped me go through it, just focus on basketball, keep working, you know. Don't listen to the, what everybody says and just keep, keep focusing on basketball. So, of course, we, we know you have the complete offensive arsenal. Players rave about your IQ, passing, scoring, just all the intangibles. Is there anything that you've added to your game in the offseason? Uh, I would say I work on everything, you know, especially shooting uh, and obviously my uh, taking care of my body, but uh, just work on everything, you know, you can get better at everything, and that's the point. So, of course, what about the kick game? I, I know that you were a sneaker-free agent, and I've, all, I've been told that you love rocking heat on your feet. Number one, who did you sign with, and what type of sneakers should we be expecting to see this season? I don't know yet. I didn't decide anything yet, uh, so we'll see about that. I'll let you know when I sign. <laughs> no doubt. And, and before I let you go, talk to KP. I, I, I've been told that he likes to play a lot of Future and Meek Mill. The last time you and I saw each other was at the NBA Awards after party. So, so are you along with KP in your music selections when you're shooting around? Who, who are you listening to? I would say I listen to a lot of, a lot of type of music. You know, I listen to USA music, like all the rappers, you know, Mika, Drake, Cardi B, of course. Uh, I listen to reggaeton, Spanish, uh, I mean, reggaeton, Slovenian music, Serbian music, so it's, it's a lot of type of music. That's right, he's a jack of all trades, very versatile, can do everything on the floor. Next time I see you, I'll make sure I have those records ready to play <laughs> for you. I got you covered. I like it. There he is right there, the reigning rookie of the year, Luca, joining us. Good luck this season. Thank you, thank you. See you soon. So apparently we get a better version of Luka Doncic going into his second season. Chris Tops